I'm going to do my 22 and 23 week update. I haven't been very regular with my pregnancy updates, um, so I kind of want to get back on track with that. Um, because of my YouTube videos at the moment have been like celebrations that have happened or um, just events or something that's significant. So I want to just give you like a regular update of what has been happening with my pregnancy. If I keep looking that way it's because of there's yobs on bikes that ride around my outside the front of my house and it's really annoying. So the last couple of weeks, I'm 23 weeks five days today so I'm just going to do like the last couple of weeks what I've been feeling what's happening so when I was 22 weeks I wrote it down by the way so when I was 22 weeks a couple of weeks ago I was having I started getting around ligament pain I'd be walking down the street it was so painful it's like a sharpness that's on your side and it made you really breathless I'd have to stop every like five ten minutes it was so painful. It was really, it was like a really, really sharp pain in your stomach. It made me really breathless and I had to walk really, really slow like an old granny. And then um, I've noticed as I've gone on, I sort of got used to it. The pain hasn't stopped, but I have got used to it. So that's, that's much better. Um, I can deal with it more now. And I know when it's gonna come on. So I just walk slower, I, I calm myself down. So I have a tendency to walk really, really fast. Um, so that's the round ligament pain. I did speak to my midwife about it and she did assure me that actually it is normal, it is fine, you will get that. Um, but obviously if it is so bad that I can't manage it, I'll phone her and sort that out because it wouldn't be normal then. Um, so I've also been getting really, really tired. I know in my first trimester I had that and in the beginning of my second I sort of got a little bit more energetic but now I'm really tired all the time again I could sleep all through the day but obviously I cannot do that <laughs> I have things to do um so but if I could I would love to sleep all day um so this week which is I'm 23 weeks today 23 weeks five days today yeah so this week I noticed at the beginning of this week my baby's kicking slowed down so his movements really really slowed down I was getting a bit worried and um, obviously there was that night a few days ago or a week ago or whatever when I actually went to the hospital because of the his kicks had slowed down and I at the beginning of this week early a week before late the week before I'm just all muddled up here um, my stomach started going really really tight I had pain with it and it was sort of coming and going quite regularly and when it started coming on regularly I noticed that actually that wasn't right I did time it and then I phoned the 111 service and they said it sounds like the pain and the consistency you would get with contractions so they wanted to phone an ambulance to be on the safe side and if you want to find out what happened on that instance, the video is already up on YouTube. So you can go back and watch that. Um, I won't really speak too much about it, but I basically, late last week and this week, I was getting tight tightenings and pain and the baby had slowed down. However, the last couple of days, the baby has been so active, but really, really low down and... I am going to the toilet so frequently because I'm scared that I'm going to pee myself because the baby's kicking so low down I can feel it in my bladder and into my vagina which actually sometimes can be quite painful um, because of the baby sitting so low down. Um, I still don't think that I look pregnant. I look bloated slash fat um, but a lot of my tops aren't fitting properly so I've gone out today and I've bought myself a new top. Um, from a plus size shop because of I was gonna buy maternity stuff but then I thought after my baby's born I might not lose the weight straight away and I probably will be in a bigger dress size so if I just buy one size up for now then while I'm losing that weight after the baby's born I still have clothes that fit me because of in reality I'm not gonna be a size 14 
after my baby is born let's get real here so and I kind of have accepted that um the other night I did get really really upset because like my body's changing and as a child I was really badly bullied um I was called oh are you pregnant oh you're fat and you're this and as a 10 11 year old that's really not nice to hear and um it was really upsetting so I've had probably body image issues my whole life and uh, seeing myself get that belly again and put that weight on again is really really hard I refuse to step on the scales my health is uh, comes around she's like have you weighed yourself like do you want to weigh yourself do you want to see how your consistency is going I was like no no way I don't want to see them numbers on that scale machine because of it 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 messes with my mind it really does whenever I see a number that I don't like I'm like I'm healthy you know I'm going on the diet and when you're pregnant a diet is not um, advised or healthy for you it's dangerous for your baby so I don't want to see them numbers because if I do then in my head I'm going to want to diet to lower those numbers and it's not healthy at all for the baby so I'm just watching what I eat I'm eating healthily I'm trying to eat all the right foods for the baby for me um so when Jackson is born I won't be as big as I could have been if I just snacked on really rubbish foods when I wasn't pregnant because when I wasn't pregnant I ate really unhealthily so this pregnancy has kind of made me more aware of what healthy foods to eat and what's okay and what's not okay so hopefully I won't put on too much weight but I am accepting of the fact that I will put on weight because I'm carrying a baby and that's okay. Hi guys, so I just wanted to show you quickly the pregnancy bump. Um, it's not really much of a bump, I don't think. Um, it looks like I'm really pushing my stomach out but I'm not, like that's it. I feel really like the camera makes it look like I'm really big but I'm just not. I feel quite fat and I have um, sorted out more of the nursery stuff um, but what I'm doing is I'm taking pictures as I go along um, so that at the end I'll just make a YouTube video on the progression of the nursery and the end result of it um, so I think I think it'll be better that way anyway um, so I'll keep you updated with that and that's my pregnancy update bye guys oh,